Hello and welcome to 11010 Morrison Mike Cell Road, New Paris, Ohio. Here I'm standing out in the driveway looking up the front of this home. First thing, this is located on three acres, very, very private. As you can see, we have no immediate neighbors to our left, no immediate neighbors to the rear. Those are both cornfields right now. And then we have the cedars slash pines over here and then cornfield immediately on this side and then cornfield all the way across. You can literally sit on the front porch and watch the deer run through that cornfield right there. So great, great home here. And this is actually a newer construction home um, built in the 90s. We have a two car attached garage. Everything is on one level. And then we have a huge one car detached garage and so really we have a three and a half car garage and this is darn near perfect shape in here new roof that was just put on just a couple days ago from the time of shooting this video plenty of parking for a boat an rv if you wanted to build a larger barn plenty of space for that as well next i'll meet you inside all right so here it just came through the front door this is the front porch right here and this is the view you have when you open your front door. Now this is probably not the door you would come in, but we do have a solid screen door on there, followed by a steel door, I'm shutting right now. And it opens into a good sized living room. We have overhead light here. You can throw a ceiling fan up there if you wish. Carpet is very good shape in here. Kind of an open floor plan that flows right into the dining room. Now all of our bedrooms will be over here to the left. We'll check those out here momentarily. This is ceramic tile. I like how they did it on a diagonal here. Very, very nice. So dining room flows right in the kitchen. So when you're sitting at the dining room, if you got the game on TV, you can actually sit at the dining room table and still watch the game. Walking through the dining room into the kitchen. The range does stay, the dishwasher does stay. And the kitchen sink overlooks the backyard. A great view out of the backyard. You can sneak peek at our covered back porch right here. The ceramic tile flows all the way into our utility room right here. So the dryer would go on the right, washer would go on the left, and then we have room for storage as well. Right here we have a half bathroom. So good location right off of the garage. And then we have kind of a mud room off of the garage with an additional back door. So this is where we come in from the garage. Have a screen door on there, and then the door going to the outside. So this is what we saw when we came through the garage here. And this has a screen door on it as well. So boom, we're right back outside. And while we're here, let's go ahead and take a look at that back patio. I could have gone out the other door, but since we are here, back patio. So great view out the back here. So big front yard, big side yard, big rear yard, plenty of privacy. So coming back into the house, normally I don't show the garage, but this is a big garage, so we'll take a peek at it in here. We do have a garage door opener. Our water heater and a brand new water softener are in here. Our whole house filter is in here as well. This garage is finished. And this does appear, appear to be an insulated door. And we do have pull down stairs here as well. Now let's go check out the bedrooms. So we're gonna walk on the other side of the home and that's that back door that I could have gone out to get to the back patio. So walking through, we're gonna go through our dining room, go through our living room, and we do have a double sliding coat closet right there. This door here is where our high efficiency carrier furnace is located. Then we have three bedrooms. Bedroom number one, this is the smallest of the three bedrooms. So this would be the kids room or the office. Then we have two more bedrooms straight ahead and then a full bathroom here. So we've seen one full bathroom, one half bathroom. And this is a one piece shower tub so don't have to caulk any seams in there. And it has a built-in linen cabinet in here, but we do have a linen closet 
here as well. So plenty of plenty of storage. Bedroom number two, and I might have these labeled differently online. We have double bifold closets here. Do have overhead lights. This is on the back left of the home, if you're looking at it from the street. And this one has a ceiling fan in it. This is what I would call the owner suite because it has an ensuite bathroom. Double sliding, and those are huge sliding closets there. This is on the front left of the home. And then another full bathroom. So we have, this, is, this one is with a walk-in shower. So we have two full bathrooms, a half bathroom, two car, really an oversized two car garage, plus an oversized one car garage. So you probably, really have the capacity of probably four car garage, but you know we're gonna call it a three car garage, definitely a three and a half car garage. Newer construction on three acres, in the country with no neighbors, this is one of those homes that I've had a lot of buyers looking for. I see this moving quickly, so give me a call or give your realtor a call. I'm sure they would be happy to show you this home, but this is a unique opportunity to spread your elbows and get that space that you've always wanted. Thanks for watching, and I look forward to talking to you.